This is Speak My Word Ministries, Travis Zimmerman. The Daily Pulse of the Day is about how God strengthens us, even through trials. And the verse I want to hold up to you is Acts chapter 20, verse 32. And it's Paul speaking, and it's, it's some encouragement. And it's going to relate to a popsicle bridge that we do in Cub Scouts, but one, one minute on that. Here's Paul. Now I commit to you, God, and to the word of his grace, which can build you up and give you an inheritance among all those who are sanctified. Acts chapter 20, verse 32, about being sanctified, being made holy, being made more and more to conform to the image of His Son as we allow ourselves to be moved and changed by God. I, I know I did a, a devotion this once before, but uh, uh, this popsicle bridge, this is what we, every year, the, the Weeblos want who are fourth graders get a chance to take 100 popsicle sticks and they've got to span a 70 centimeter, I'm sorry, 70 inch uh, span. And they're allowed to use wood glue, and that's it. And you know, this bridge sits up there and end up putting up weights on the top. And the one that ended up winning held 107.5 pounds. I mean, we ran out of plates. It was the Larkin Bridge. It did so well. But, you know, as, as you imagine this bridge, you know, that there are certain members in it that are critical members and certain members that are, that are supporting members. You know, they all work together, but there's some members, if you take out, will be instant failure. It's, it's almost like in your house, there's a beam. You know, you have the, the, the you have the, the gypsum board, the, the, the wall board, and, and some of the, the, you know, the joists that are, you know, important, but if you take out that eye beam, the whole house collapses. You know, and, and that's the way it works. Same way with these bridges. So the, the, what God put in my heart, as, as we're going through our lives, you know, we get loaded down, don't we? You know, we get loaded down by stress, by pressure, by the demands of life, and it becomes so unbearable. You know, we're under stress, and it's almost like God says, you know, I'm going to take away this one little piece. I'm going to take away this piece right here, remove it. And you're like, no, 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 God, you can't. And he takes it away. And then he takes away another one. So in, in that instance, it's like, I'm going to take away your dad. Boom. No, 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 God, you can't. Oh, it held. The bridge held. I'm going to strike your mother with cancer. Oh, no, no. And the bridge holds. Travis, I'm going to take you out of a job. In fact, take you out of three jobs. No, no, God, please don't. He takes away that. And he takes, you know, I'm going, to, I'm going to take away your son so he, 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 you know, he's going to break his leg so he's out of commission for a while. And your wife's going to fall downstairs and have kidney infections and, and pulmonary emboli. He keeps taking it out of that bridge. And we're like, no, 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 God, you can't. But you know what? That's part of the sanctification process. The part of being conformed more and more like our, his son, Jesus Christ. And the things that we think are critical, you know, he doesn't say he's going to take them away forever. You know, he brings them back and he brings things in to, to, to replace him, and not replace, you know, he can't replace dad, but things that will, that will help us. And that's in the way of, of his grace, his grace. And that comes through family, that comes through friends, helping out, pitching in. My grace is sufficient for you, for my power is made perfect in weakness, Jesus says. Lord, thank you for that reminder that you are sufficient for us. You will build us up in your love, regardless of what you take or what you give. You are in control and in charge, and we trust you in all of these things. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, amen.